Hey guys, how's it going? DJ2 here, and welcome back to Fortnite Save the World, and welcome to Season 7. Yes, Season 7 is here, guys. Season 7 of Save the World, and it brings with it Hexylvania right here. We've got dungeons, and of course, we have the Lars Pack, which we are going to take a look at. Uh, but first, before we jump into this, guys, I just want to say thank you very much for you being here. Thank you for watching, guys. Thank you, all of you guys, using my creator code right there, DUJ2. It's on the bottom of the screen. Thank you so very much. You guys are amazing. For all of you guys who are wondering where I am, why I don't have a camera and all that, go check out my channel update video, which I released yesterday. Uh, I am in Seattle right now. I am in Seattle at PAX West, and it is almost 1 a.m. at the time of me making this video. I have been extremely busy. I have not had a chance to make videos or stream that I really wanted to, but I will be updating you guys soon. And don't forget, we will, I promise, we will be doing the, uh, what's that called? The Q&A video, guys. We will be doing the Q&A video on Monday. It may not be coming out very, uh, well, there it is, boom, there it is. So the Q&A video, guys, it will be coming out on Monday. It may not be coming out um, at, I don't know what time it might come out. It might come out very late in the evening. But for those of you who are wondering, yes, you still have a chance, guys. You still have a chance to go ahead and get yourself into this. So if you want a chance to win the 1,000 V-Bucks that's currently going on, all you got to do is go check out the Q&A video, comment on that video. And yes, we will be starting a new giveaway for 2,800 V-Bucks right here. Uh, as well as you guys know that depending how many uh, entries we get into that video, how many comments we get, we may do a larger giveaway. So go watch the Q&A video if you want some more information for that. And let's jump into this. So we've got Hexylvania, guys. The Hexylvania Adventure Season is back. Complete Bone Chilling quest lines and unlock your, unlock your fair share of candy, golden heroes. Dungeons is also back. Fight monsters, dodge traps, gear up and descend to the desk to confront the raging evil below. Complete dungeons to unlock heroes, candy, a loading screen, and more in the dungeons. And of course, the Lars pack. Okay, so uh, yeah, we will take a look at the Lars pack, guys. Grab the Lars pack to unlock a new hero and unlock outfit. Uh, the end locker outfit, the storm strummer, backling, the prop chop pickaxe, and complete the Lars challenges to earn 1,000 V Bucks. Am I going to buy this one? I, I can't tell you guys. I don't know. I don't know yet. Uh, we've got Wolfie Business. We've got the Hexylvania Adventures. And we've got Dungeons. So right now we only have one quest line. Man, that looks really good actually. Uh, you know what? We're going to start here. We're going to start. Oh. Oh. Okay. So Lockbot is still here? Is it just here for... Y you know what? I don't know. I don't know when it's going to go away. Um, I... I'm tempted to buy it, but I'm not going to. If I could buy it with V-Bucks, I would. All right, there's the Lars, uh, the Lars pack. Access the Save the World PV campaign. Uh, Lars hero right here, the Lars outfit. You know, I, I can't, you know what? You know what? You guys want to know why I can't do it? Uh, he just, he, I don't know. You know what? I, I just, I... I it doesn't look like Lars. Look at him. He just, y you know what he looks like? <laughs> he, he looks like, uh, he kind of looks like PewDiePie. <laughs> they, they put PewDiePie in the game. Um, and you know what? It's the eyes, I think. I don't know. I don't know. It's, you know what? Hashtag not my Lars. <laughs> the prop chop pickaxe that is very cool and uh we've got the back bling, the storm summer storm strummer back bling. that is cool back bling. i'm gonna tell you that is that is a gorgeous back bling. i wonder if it's reactive or if that moves at all and the pickaxe is really cool but you're not really gonna understand if you unless you do ride lightnings um yeah i don't know i don't know i i'm i'm confused you know what i i as much as i love lars guys i'd have to hear if he has the voice uh voice lines uh we didn't get a mini quest line either yeah no mini quest line so you know what you know what I, i'm not gonna get into it right now i promise i will do a video with my thoughts on the lars pack 
my thoughts on no mini quests my thoughts on how they basically yeah i mean we we had we got her we got clip we got clip we got uh where's um where is he is he in upgrades no he's not in upgrades i forget where we see the uh huh in heroes there he is there he is there he is um and then in survivors is where we see yeah that's where we see the director uh yeah i mean there we got some really interesting quest lines for, for both for him uh we got a very interesting quest line for the what what is he colonel sergeant major major he's a major um we got some we got some really interesting quest lines for all of them and then both ray and lars two of the most two of the most iconic heroes at home base oh you know what you know like i said i'm not gonna get into it right now you're just gonna have to wait yes i will do a video talking about this i will dive into it my feelings on this but let's move on <laughs> let's move on hexylvania adventure zone uh the hexylvania adventure zone right now we've got the short range so uh let's see if we yes here we are short range Enemies close to a player or defender suffer more damage. Those far away suffer less. All enemies have a chance to drop healing pickup when eliminated. So obviously we need some up close and dangerous hero loadouts. Uh, I'm going to tell you right now, you're just going to have to keep an eye out guys. I promise hopefully in the next couple of days, I will do the video that I do at the very beginning of every season, which is my recommended hero loadouts for that current season. Uh, I will tell you right now, you are going to see, of course, Pale Luna. You're going to see Pale Luna. You're going to see Seawolf Jonesy with the double high tide. Oh yes. That double shockwave. We're definitely going to see him. And then uh cassie for grinding and here i don't think we're gonna see anyone else here uh no 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 well oh yeah 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 director riggs we'll see director riggs also because we are in dungeon season so this is probably my uh, this is one of my favorite loadouts for that uh and ice king well that's for that's for jail builds and overtaker hero well overtaker hero wouldn't be bad too because he's going to be up close and personal too um i don't know i don't know we're gonna have to wait and see i promise i will do a shotgun build as well as probably we will have a gold nox in here as well uh, maybe instead of the Star Spangled Headhunter and instead of Master of the Year Grenier's, you know what? We're probably going to be able to put a shotgun built there. But yes, I will do a video where I will go through and I'll show you guys my recommended builds for this season, season seven, in which we've got this very interesting short range. Uh, so we need to definitely be within two squares, within two spaces of all the, it's two, I think it's two. Yeah, I think it's two tiles. Within two tiles of enemies to do the maximum amount of damage. And because of that, you know, the long range damage, especially snipers or xenon bow and all that, those are not going to be the ones here. I really do hope that we're going to see a lot of shotguns though. A lot of shotguns and maybe even the uh, paper shredder. Paper Shadow would be pretty awesome in here. All right, so there we go for that. Uh, finally, we've got uh, the dungeons, guys. You guys know how dungeons work. Gotta love them. Uh, are all the same? Let's see. Are all the same dungeons? Yes, all the same dungeons rewards are back. So if this is the first time that you are running dungeons, congratulations. You get yourself all these awesome things, including all the little banners and everything. So that's awesome. Congratulations. That is really, really great for everyone who is new to Dungeons. Wolfie Business, you got to do it. I think this is the way that you get the director, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, someone please correct me if I'm wrong. And uh, weekly challenges. Oh, man, I have got to do some 160s. Uh, I only have to do... Wait, how many do I have to do? I have to do 10 for a hero supercharger. Ooh, okay. Um, You know what? I don't even know if I'm going to have time before Wednesday. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna have to see if i have time i may have to play offline i may have to play off stream a bit uh to catch up on here because i am just running behind on so many things but that is it guys finally oh look at here look who we have here look who we have here we have a mythic guy wow unfortunately i don't need him but that's up you know what let's take a look at that site 
What's that scythe guy? Affliction. Uh, love the scythe as well. Um, yeah, unfortunately I don't need him, but that is a, if I could give this, if I could buy this llama for someone, I would. That is a beautiful llama. Uh, my birthday llamas are still there. We've got the Fort Nightmares llamas. You guys know what that means. And in the items we have, let's take a quick look. We've got Ragnarok. We've got the Tiny Instrument of Death. We've got the Stormblade. Ooh, Stormblade. Um, you know what? I don't know what perk the Stormblade comes with. We'll check it out. Uh, Support Specialist Hawk. And I cannot take, I cannot buy any more armor slots. I am maxed out. Let's wrap it up by taking a look at the Stormblade. I am not sure what I can get with the Stormblade. Um, bu -bu 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 -bu. there's a Stormblade. Yes, yes, yes. Modify perks. Affliction. Damage dealt with this weapon snares. After eliminating five enemies with this weapon within 15 seconds, regenerate 10 of your shield. Critical hits with the weapon cause an explosion, damaging enemies with them. Ooh. Oh my. Oh my. That is gorgeous. Can you imagine how many, wait, 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 how many crits can we put on this? One crit, uh, critical rating. Uh, no, no, uh, critical rating. Uh, ooh, a critical storm blade, a double critical storm blade with critical damage and okay. All right. All right. Um, so this one has critical, this one does not, but this one has movement speed, a life leech. Okay. We can do life leech. We could do life leech. Um, double attack speed. I have currently have double attack speed. That would ha that would have to turn to double crit. That would have to turn into double crit, and this one have to turn into damage to miss monsters and bosses. So a double crit, life leech, stormblade. With that perk, with that perk right there, with that perk right there. That sounds absolutely devastating. That sounds like it could be absolutely devastating. Let's take a quick look and see if we don't have a Stormblade currently. Maybe we have one that already has it. Affliction, 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 Affliction. No. Um, do Stormblades come in Epic? They should, right? I mean, it's an OG weapon. Uh, bu -bu 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 oh my goodness, look at all those bats. <laughs> look at all. Oh my gosh, look at all those clubs. Um, it, oh, there we do. We do. We do have, okay. We have a new one. We have a new one. Uh, let's check, uh, let's take a look at the upgrade. Let's take a look at the rarity and snares. So for those of you who don't know epic weapons, you can just go ahead and you can check the increased rarity and you can see what they're going to turn into. Careful. Don't hit this confirm rarity. Uh, I'm not going to, I'm not going to admit or deny that I've done that in the past, uh, affliction as well. And maybe. If we're lucky, one of these will get. So whenever you take an epic weapon to legendary, you will it will obviously get that passive perk. And it really is a matter of RNG what that is going to be. Um, sometimes they get something good, sometimes they don't. That's affliction. But once it's uh, it's pretty much coded into there. And no, okay, so I have a bunch of Stormblades, even Epic Stormblades, but none of them, and I don't believe, yeah, it's not in blue. Uh, none of them are getting me that perk, so I'm probably going to buy that one and hope that it gives me a good one. Hope, Hopefully we get that critical one because I am really interested in making a double crit, double crit rate Stormblade now with healing and that explosion perk. Uh, that would be really interesting. Yeah, that would be fun. So, so there you go. Um, for those of you wondering if you wanted that, you got a sneak peek into the must-have of this. So there we go. That's it, guys. That is it. Welcome to Season 7 of Fortnite Save the World, where we have Hexylvania and Dungeons back. Um, I, as always, you know, it's pretty much the same thing that we've had before. If you are new to the game, congratulations. This is a fantastic time to play. It's so much fun. Dungeons are incredibly fun. As well as this ventures, I kind of like this ventures. Like I said, I will be doing a video soon showing off the best builds that I recommend, the best hero loadouts for this season. You guys know I do that at the beginning of every single season. So keep an eye out for that video. Hopefully, I can do it very, very soon. 
And uh, like I said, if you guys would like to enter the Q&A video, the Q&A giveaway, you still have, uh, let's say you have a, yourself a, you have a day still. <laughs> so you have a day to enter this one. Just go ahead. You know what? I'll try and leave a link down below in the description so you can go straight to this one. Leave a comment on the video to enter the giveaway and just keep an eye out because I try to every single Monday do a giveaway and you're going to want to watch the next one because the next one will i promise we will start with a 2800 v buck gift card that's what we're going to start with and like i said if we have a certain number of comments a certain number certain number of entries into the next one or i guess into the current one we're going to bump it up we're going to bump it up and we may even do a 13,500 v buck someday and if we get a bunch of likes i said if we get a thousand likes on one of those videos the q a videos one day we'll double it so if we get let's say 200 comments on one of those videos and a thousand likes we will do two yes two 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 thousand eight hundred viewer gift cards so it's up to you guys thanks a lot for watching guys as always i am duj2 if you guys enjoy this video if you enjoy what i do on my channel please do me a huge favor and have yourself a fantastic day Thanks a lot for watching, guys. And whew, season seven, Lars, crazy. I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.